How's it going everybody, Goldhead here, and welcome back to the channel. This is going to be entry 24 of my Cyberpunk 2077 walkthrough guide, and in this entry, we are going to be focusing on the River storyline. So in order to start the River storyline, what we'll need to do is start the side job, I Fought the Law. Now in order to get this side job, you'll actually have to answer a phone call from Elizabeth. This will happen around the time that V dies and wakes back up after Jackie dies and Dex screws you over. But once you get that phone call from Elizabeth, you'll be able to start the I Fought the Law mission. So if for some reason you do not have this mission, what I recommend is to get the campaign all the way to the OP55N1 mission, which is the last mission of the game. And by then, surely Elizabeth will call you. And then that way you can start the I Fought the Law mission. Now, the first objective for this mission is to go meet okay. up with her. Once you arrive, you are going to do a brain dance in this. I'm going to leave all this in here in case you're having any issues, and I will talk to you right after. What do you got for me? Carter, let's go. Straight to the matter at hand, huh? <laughs> My time's pretty valuable. Pretty sure yours is too? True. Elizabeth? Well, as you're probably aware, Mayor Lucius Rhine recently passed. We want to know how, why, whatever else is pertinent. As far as I remember, someone tried to zero Ryan a few days before his death. The NCPD sees no link. They're saying it was a random cyber-psycho attack. And claiming the mayor died of natural causes. Causes unrelated to the attack. It's in the official reports. Ryan died at home due to a cardio implant malfunction. What makes you think the cops got him wrong? Got any evidence? Shortly before Ryan passed, he made cuts in the NCPD budget. Perhaps got on someone's bad side that way. In any case, we have the cyber psycho attack on a BD. Our chief of security scanned it, but didn't find anything out of the ordinary, so to speak. We need a brain dance editor, a real one. It's raw footage. The brain dance. It has to be back where it belongs today, or a lot of people will be in a lot of trouble. If you agree to help, you can see it right now. All right, see what I can do. Excellent. We'd be happy with any find that would clarify things. Alleviate lingering doubts. Well, what do we got here? Question is, what are you doing here? My brain, too, isn't it? In this time, you'll go school and ask your seat. Stop me. Let's make a joke. Oh, stop in here. Stop in here. Stop in here. Stop in here. Who's the Hulk guy? No idea. Those ass clowns are all the same. Second conference in three days. No idea what this blitz is for. That's why I'm mayor and you're not. Now's when we need the visibility. You're spreading yourself too thin. I'll rest tonight. My room at the Red Queen's race is ready. Yes, of course. Good. Now go. Gotta practice. Red Queen's race. Cause any intersynapse zaps? Sure, a bunch of old Brit farts and powdered wigs shouting off with their heads. You know, you're allowed to say you don't have a clue. They left literally seconds before. 
before the attack. Looks planned. Like it was done on purpose. That or the psycho saw his chance and took it. Don't get paranoid on me. Cop wanted to tell security something. Probably that he was standing by to lick Ryan's butthole. Could have chromed half the city with what he was packing. Probably what happened. Body disappeared from the morgue, sight unseen. And then some pig got himself a new set of wheels in an ugly ass suit. Know that? Or just talking out your ass again? Once you've seen all I've seen, don't need to know things to know them. People are the same everywhere. Okay, it's coming out your ass. <laughs> Do it after the conference. The tune. Don't recognize it. Tune? What is humming? Wouldn't call that a tune. He's really into it. Terminal crashed right as he went through the gate. Glitch was no accident. Nah, seen stranger coincidences. Like? Like when you bang some chick and then her sister later, same night. And it turns out they're both sisters of God. That really happened to you? Nah, but it could have. Oh, well, well. <laughs> See anything suspicious? Anything at all? Or are we paranoid? Rather not jump to any conclusions. That's not much to go on. Still too early to say. Sure, sure. Any questions at this point? Cop who saved Ryan. Know anything about him? Detective River Ward. Good guy. We worked a few cases together. You want to talk to him? I'll put you in touch. Ward had great timing. Either has crazy good luck or had a source. Got good info. I'm gonna need some of each. Well said. Sending you his deeds. If you need anything else, let us know. We'll help. So after you get that dialogue, your next objective here is to call River Ward right off of your cell phone. You're just going to hit down on the D-pad and that way we can pull up our cell phone. You'll flip through your contacts and find River. Once you do that, he'll give you a meeting location and we are going to get that cutscene and dialogue. Through this entry, I am going to be cutting out all the travel Jefferson scenes, but I am going to leave all the dialogue in there because there are choices here so you can get your romance scene if you want that. If you do not want the romance scene, do not worry. You can still get your achievement slash trophy at the end. I just want to let you know that, and I'll talk to you right after the cutscene. Be there, stat. Someone here to see you, looks like. Oh, wonder what about. Wanted to talk. You got a minute? You must be the partner, Detective Han. Okay. Thanks for agreeing to me. You really intend to work with a merc? Don't know what I intend just yet. Now I'm gonna see if I hear anything new about Ryan's death. You back on that? The boss already told you to drop it. You can say it again. You know he hates to say things twice. 
And if you couldn't give a rat's fat ass about any of that, heed my advice. As your friend, just let the case go. You see me do anything? Just sitting here, sipping coffee, listening to gossip. Fine. Do what you want. What about the Gotta go get my little girl anyway. And you two at least find a quieter corner. Wouldn't want to be over her. Okay. Talk. See, Detective Han's not a fan of edge runners. Don't take it personally. Detective Han's not a fan of anybody, except his daughter. You wanted to talk? For the attack, you wanted to talk to Ryan's hustle. It's some info to him. What was it? You know what? Mom was right. Acoustics are a little too good in here. Got my car outside. Okay, sure. from the precinct saw Horvath around Arroyo, shooting up dumpsters, hollering how he's got to meet with the mayor. Brought him in. Brought who in? Peter Horvath. Cyber psycho who attacked the mayor later. He took him downtown, but then he got lost before they could get his statement. Said he got lost. How's that happen? What's it mean? It means someone didn't want him counting roaches in a cell that day. Before you ask me, no. I got no idea who. My turn. Why is Perales looking at this now? Why does he want it done unofficial on the hush hush? So I will be cutting out this car ride because nothing exciting will happen or any dialogue choices. We will arrive at this location where we will do an interrogation, which I'll leave this in here and I'll talk to you right after. My guy works here. You go talk to him. I'll wait outside. Tell him Igor says hi. He'll know what it's about. All right. Wait here then. You're looking for a uh, general inspiration or something specific? Because I can help with both. Igor says hi. No. I said I was done. I was out. Of recommended days, but leave the fuck alone, all of you. Hey, Neil, piss off. Relax, just got one question to ask you. Nothing to see here, sir. Come on, ghost, I said. Leave me alone, got it? Can't make me do a damn thing. We can, actually. And we will. Just tell us where to find Red Queen's race. I don't know! So fucking remember. And make it quick. All right. Jesus. Chill, okay? It's outside city limits, near the river, Benita Street area. You been there? Not telling you another fucking thing. Kiss my ass, both of you. Well, well, that's what I call a breakthrough. It seems promising, but I'd still hit that market. Market? Horvath's employer, one I mentioned before. I just wouldn't let that lead drop. Okay. Let's go see this market of yours. We're gonna take my car? Sure, thanks.
Welcome to N54 News. I'm Jillian Jordan. We begin now with your latest local news. So I'm going to cut this traveling out as well, but we are going to the Blossom Market where we're going to do a little bit more interrogation. We will have a dialogue choice at the end of this, and that is just when the guys are trying to loot his car. Now, you can do any choice here. It will not affect the romance or the achievement slash trophy, but overall, we want to get through that to get to our next mission. we change tacks this time? Ask questions first, then level threats. So, who are we supposed to talk to? Cyber Psycho's boss, you said? Christine Markov, 42. File has her as Horvath's sole employer. Sole contact, too, actually. Come on. idea who we're looking for. Gonna have to ask around. I'll start from the left and take the right. I'm not afraid of anyone, you know? Hey, Christine Markov? No, but I know who she is. Christine Stand Markov. with the tape over on the other side. Okay, you Christine Markov? We have some questions. You badges? Looking for data on Petar Horva. Worked here, apparently? Yeah, he did. Then he stopped working, started making fucking speeches all the time. These speeches. What did he have to say? Ryan, a corpse got him by the balls and cock, but he still managed to fuck me. His motto. Why do you have it in for the mayor? Ha! <laughs> Looking for reason in that whack job? Probably thought Ryan was talking to him through the TV, promising all sorts of shit, then ceasing to give a fuck. Look, I told you what I think. In Horvath's world, everybody was out to get him. Lucius Ryan was out to fuck him, then get him. Had no other connection, those two. Think hard. Easy money? That's what Horvath was after. Didn't do time for nothing. Worked for normals, not so normals. Maybe he and Ryan had some mutual friends. Would that be all, detectives? You're spooking my clientele. So Horvath had a personal beef with Ryan. We might have guessed as much. Might seem like we didn't get a lot out of that. Sometimes intel makes sense once you've got some context. Say, for instance, somebody says they got a headache. Minor detail. Means nothing, right? Usually, sure. But then the guy waltzes straight into oncoming traffic. The neighbor remembers someone had worked on the air conditioner in the guy's unit. The guy whose head always hurt. Accident? Coincidence? Or maybe air dispersed poison. A deliberate hit. You actually caught a case like that? No. Made it up. Still proves my point. Oh, great. Let me handle this, V. Step aside, Lug. Your boyfriend got sent up for years. Doubt you want the same. Gentlemen, gentlemen, chill, please. <laughs> Jump, clown! Jump! What the fuck?! Walking the streets with you? Downright unsafe. 
Got a beef with all gangs or just the tigers? I'm a cop. What do you think? Uh, gotta report this. Okay. We're at Queen's Race now. First, I gotta clean up the mess you made. We'll meet there. So for our next objective here is to go to that address that we've gotten from the informant. Once you get here, you will have to talk to River outside of here. I am going to show you this whole mission. You want to sneak around to the that. left and sneak Welcome into one of the crates. Recently. I'll leave this in here Probably. in case you're having any problems, and I'll talk to you right after. Pigs either. I can't go in without a warrant. But you. Uh-huh. All right. Be in touch. You find anything, tell me. Looks like a normal body shop to me. Club's here. I'm telling you. Telling me you got a hunch. Cop intuition? Something like that. Stairs inside. Clever. Nice. Someone really wanted to cover up whatever it was that went down. What should we be looking for? Let's try to find something that looks like an office. Every club has one. Oh, 
Me? Wasn't a heart attack that killed Ryan. As I said from the start. But. So it spiked his BD. That's what killed him. Fuck. I think you could be right. Come on, V. Looks like an office. Sort of. Comps are what we want. Comps above all. Stiff as a board. You ask me, he's been dead at least an hour. No. No trauma cut. Pretty sure he didn't bring it on purpose. A uh, club like this, you don't want TT banging down the door when you're banging away and things start to heat up. Hard, probably. Must have gotten a little too heavy and messy. Okay. Yeah, let's do that. Coroner will find him at home. I'll tell him how to write it up. Died in his sleep, quiet as a baby. Boys are getting him out of here. Of course, nobody will see him. No way. Yep. Yeah. Yes. 
All right, I'll buzz you later. Weird. Guy looks familiar, doesn't he? V? I'm not in the mood for jokes. Think we've seen everything we needed to. Let's go. Okay. Let's Delta. Think I saw another way out on the way in. with this punk shot it Harold I know what you did not about to ask why you covered it up not even why you jumped into this mess to begin with just want to know who gave you the order what's the matter River why do you even care your conscience is clear you can sleep tight at night you know why because I took all the responsibility you got no idea how this city works Think a goddamn inspirational idealist bullshit actually means something? It doesn't. Never did. Hey, don't look at me that way, Merc. You know I'm right. <laughs> don't drag me into this. I don't do politics or NCPD in her squabbles. Yeah, so what do you do? Let me guess. Whatever brings in the ads, huh? It's typical. Now, I'm not surprised, but I'm not judging either. Looking for a path and place in this damn city. All of us. Looking for a path and a place. That's right. Great. We understand each other. V. Appreciate the help. But this isn't your biz. I'll take care of it. How are you gonna do that? Am I under arrest? I've got a scroll, got a motive, got your confession. So yeah, you could be. Wouldn't make much sense. You don't even gotta say who ordered you to go and clean up. I know anyway. So, since even our brass's fingers are all over this, I gotta take it to internal. They won't do a thing either. Not to me. They'll put you in their sights, though. Just go home, Ward. Get some sleep. Find all this easier to take in in the morning. I mean, that's my plan. That's why I believe it. Use the NCPD to cover his tracks. Also think it was Holt. The only one who stood to gain. Taking this to internal affairs. Got enough to get this case reopened. Do it. And you? Gonna report back to the paralysis? Yep. Okay. I'm gonna stay. Observe a little. Thanks, V. So, about Ryan, got a pretty good idea what happened. Great. Come by, please. It's a sensitive matter. I'd rather discuss it face to face. We'll be waiting.
next up in our objectives we are going to head over to the apartment i'm going to skip out all that traveling we are going to go to the top floor from the elevator we are going to get some dialogue and that is going to open up our next mission Thanks. And I do want to point out that none of the other dialogue choices outside of River will affect his romance scene, but you do want to go along with any missions that they give you. Just going to tell you one thing. I'm listening. Don't tell him nothing. Don't get involved. This muck is deeper than you think. Suck you in if you're not careful. I'm always careful. Fine, do whatever the fuck you want. Not like you listen anyway. Hello, V. Please, come in. Make yourself at home. Jefferson will join us shortly. Please. Have a seat. Thank you. Good to see you, V. Elizabeth tells me you have answers for us. I'm all ears. Cases. Pretty complex. Leaves a lot of questions unanswered. Rather not draw any conclusions yet. But you must have an opinion. Jeff, honey, read between the lines. The case is complicated, but dying at home of a cardiac malfunction, that's not complicated. So we were right? Yes. And that's enough for me. We have to be careful. Very careful, Jeff. That's what V's trying to tell us. Thanks for your help, V. Your fee. Glad I could help. Hey there. Now, where did we leave off? Now for the last objective for I Fought The Law was to leave the building. And the next thing you want to do is get out of that area and start skipping time. Over. Start skipping 24 hour spots and checking for a phone call every time. If he still hasn't called, what you can do is just start driving around, stay idle for about five minutes. If that still doesn't work, you can try saving your game, closing out the game, pulling it back up, spawning back in, and seeing if he calls. Another thing you can try is going to your apartment, sleeping three times in a row, wake up, take the elevator down the stairs, and then once you get outside, start skipping time again and checking for that phone call. With this phone call, though, he is going to give us the hunt mission, and we are waiting for coordinates here. Now, once he sends you the text, you can just open it from the D-pad, but if you're having any issues with finding these coordinates because you didn't open this text message up when it was on the screen, what you can do is just flip out your phone, go down to River as a contact, and then open up his messages. But either way, once you get those coordinates, we are going to head to our next destination. I'm going to go ahead and skip at all that traveling. Once we arrive, we can just wait for River to pull up, and we are ready for our dialogue. This is the place. Tick, 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 tick. Where there's smoke. 
Hey, V. How you holding up? Been better. So, dreams? You heard me. Come on, I'll explain on the way. It's an experimental procedure, but it's already yielding results. They record dreams that can be played back as BDs. Got access to these dreams? Not yet. They keep them in the lab we're headed to now. Okay. Got an appointment? Not exactly. We'll go in together, but, uh, not through the main entrance. Oh, we're gonna break the law. We'll find a different way in, and then hustle out quick. Never actually been here, so I'll need your help. How'd you know about the audit? I did my homework. Know where they're keeping the BD? Likely the room where they edit the autistic kids' dreams. Should be labeled as Anthony Harris. I think I got it. Found something? Not yet. Anthony Harris. Let's try these drawers. Say, River, why not just have a janitor crack a door for you? Can't risk getting scolded for sniffing around somebody else's River. case. Yoan! What are you doing here? You got kicked off the force! Just suspended, actually. And who might you be? I'm calling the actual police. Oh, wait, 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 here. Hear me out, please. Seriously, River? You weren't in enough trouble already? Harris kidnapped my nephew. I'm sorry. Really, I am. But we store evidence here, and we have strict protocols. Huh, protocols? Talking about his nephew's life here. A child's life. This is an ongoing police investigation. Go, please. 
Get to out Can't leave now. Peter Pan's dreams. I'll see it one last time. Out! Damn it, Yawin. Who the fuck do you think you are? Remember your first med school exam? You know the one. Passed it with flying colors. Gotta remember it. Ladies room erupted in flame. They evacuated everybody for two hours. I cannot believe you would throw that in my face. I never wish to see you here again. Especially you. This man, he only takes. He never gives anything back. River and I get along, we're friends. Hasn't let me down yet. Huh, I thought us friends too. That why you're refusing to help him out? Harris is dream beady. Where is it? He isn't dreaming. What? Why? A bullet damaged his cerebral cortex. We get only dissonant urges. Pieces. Looks like a dead end, River. I'm sorry. Audio-visual stimulation. That's what we gotta try. But he isn't on the spectrum. A favorite song or movie helps you reach the kids. Might be worth a try. I am aware of the similarity. Hypothalamus stimulation and hormone production. But Harris is not a child. I have never tried the procedure on an adult. Let's try it. We don't even know his preferences. I'll find something. That mean you're willing to try? Just go. I'll open the front door for you. Let's ride, V. I know exactly where to start. seem to like you. Could be this one sniffing around for something extra. <laughs> no, River's all right. Mm, yeah. Can tell you got something to say, so say it. Me? No, no. Just maybe this cop's flying straight in your pants. Find an observation on human behavior coming from a fucking stack of data in my head. Got booted off the force. Uh, suspended. Mayor's death stank to high heaven. Inquest into, kicked under the rug. So I made a fuss. Not worth asking how you feel. Well, he used to come over every weekend. Time to go. And changed it all since? Places like this never change. Lovely neighborhood. Mwah. River. You either got business with me or news about my Randy. Wouldn't drag your butt out here if you didn't. Joss, meet V. 
Sovi, is this about my Randy? Randy's been taken. Why didn't you call? Joss, I... Uh... Throw a blanket over the truth, like always. Police caught the guy, but he caught a bullet and he's in a coma being watched. But where's Randy? We're looking, Joss. Here? Listen, we need to look through Randy's things. Why? To find any lead we can. Trust me, Joss. Just don't destroy anything. Randy doesn't like it when anyone pokes through his stuff. Let's go, V. The kids are playing outside. Tell them it's time to eat. What's on your mind? I think all the women in your life have character. That's the trailer. Eyes peeled for details, eh? Uncle River! Monique! Dorian. Hey, guys. Is this your girlfriend? Just a friend. You gonna stay over? We'll see. Your mom's waiting for you with dinner. This is their old trailer. Randy moved in when I bought him a new one. Real hellhole. Like in my good old days. You check around, I'll check the trash. Tainted Overlord. Favorite band. You know him well. He used to send him an album every year for his B day. Locked. Know where the key might be? Nope. Expensive tech. Randy had the scratch for this? You're joking. No chance Randy could afford hardware like that. Got this. some kind of key here. Way too pricey. Little fossil. Not quite. We gotta get in. Some kind of game but here. I doubt anyone knows Shipping code on it. Can you crack it? Let me give it a shot. Eureka. Help me scour this, will you? Something deeply fucked about that cartoon. My skin's crawling. They caught Harris in a vehicle like that. Blockaded street. Shit, River, I remember that day. He lives close to an old school. True angel of empathy, this guy, huh? <sighs> Figured out Randy's identity. Sent him the game as a present. The one you found in his drawer? The same. 
Shipping code suggests the prick sent it from the Badlands. This guy baited Randy like a pro. River, do you... Are you seeing what I'm seeing? No. There's no way. Why would he do that? Not only did they agree to meet, but it looks like Randy was as excited as any kid on his way to a theme park. Fuck. This creep definitely scrambled Randy's head. Natalie must have been the only person Randy trusted. Can we view this page with a link? Some kind of link. The one Randy wrote about? Let's find out. A hidden page set up by Anthony Harris. Christ. Oh, I'm gonna be sick. Preyed on troubled kids, made habit to target boys like Randy. This is my fault. If I just paid more attention, just talked with him more. Hey, come on. You're not the one to blame here. The name of Delita looks like, but the name's still there. That name. It wasn't the video file on Randy's Randy comp called something it. like that. Sure, but V, don't you get it? This could be the key to Harris's mind. Here's hoping. Hey, uh, can you use any of that Netrunner magic to shake anything else out of this? Not that kind of magician. Oh, okay. We'll have to manage without it. That cartoon, River, could be what we've been looking for. Said yourself we need something that'd get Harris to dream. Send it to Yawin. Right. Sending it now. Okay. Says she'll get back to me by morning. And that I am a son of a bitch. And, uh, uh, come on. Let's grab a bite. Listen, let's not worry Joss more than we need to, huh? We're hot on the trail, we'll know more tomorrow. That's it. Done. 
Off to bed, then. We left some for you, Uncle River. Thanks, Monique. Tell me you found something. I sent some evidence to the lab. There's a chance we could know where to find Randy by morning. When's the last time you ate? Yesterday. Have mine. I'm not hungry. Thanks. Maybe later. Now you? No bullshit. Don't look at my brother. Just tell me. Will you find my boy? River's a hell of an investigator. Brandy's good as found. Won't give up until I do, Joss. Joss, you mind if V takes Randy's trailer for the night? No. Sure. Stay in, right? You gotta help me see this through. To the end. Of course I'll stay. Find your way, all right? Yep. Gonna go hit the sack soon. Can't be easy, raising three kids on your own. Well, it wasn't any easier with my husband. In fact, the best days were when he didn't come home. There were times I wished he'd disappear for a month, just to not have him hang around. V, wake up. Not done sleeping. Yawin called. It worked. The cartoon. He's dreaming. You, you got the BD? Right here. Slot it in. Jack into the computer. I want to see it on the monitor. That dock of yours is quick. Not bad. Old one. Dating from 2042, first place in an interscholastic wrestling tournament. Now hold on. Let me check which school won that tournament. Laguna Bend. Uh, looks like the whole town got flooded in the 50s. Well, at least we know the general area where Harris lived. Guess that'd be that. Huh, I recognize this shooting. It was a case study back at the academy. Got no way. 
great ID, and the kid's father was a real hard ass. For hormones! Ah, that's our cartoon. Little Tony really seemed to love it. Yes, that'll be that. Supplements in the feed for disease-free livestock. <laughs> Cattle injectors for hormones, antibiotics. People ate meat loaded with the shit. <laughs> Looks like a cattle bio scanner for checking vitals. See that? Cow sick, like the rest. Treats the kidnapped boys like cattle. You see? We were Machine controls an injection system. Stimulants, hormones, something. Signage on the farm model points to Petrochem. Search stamp right here. City South. Perfect. Terminal controls the pens. <sighs> Look, another one. or something here at some point. Looks like Peter Pan turned this farm into a goddamn final bastion. All these turrets and mines, they're controlled by some other tech, not the comp in the barn. Got a clock, an hour to midnight. Got some cables. Uh, 
hearing what I'm hearing? Trash barge. That's the signal to dump. Has to be a landfill nearby. Hey, the Illuminated Towers. Promoting the Us Cracks album that came out then. Colors changed every hour. I think that might be it. Okay, so where do we sit now exactly? We know Harris still lives near an old school that's now underwater. You can see the NC skyline and the Us Cracks Towers from the farm. It's a few miles out. Farms located near a landfill. We know that too. Shipping code on the game Randy got from Harris traces out to the Badlands. Those towers promoting the Us Cracks album. Colors change regularly, once an hour. So we know the time. Eleven at night. Right. And that puts the farm east of the city. Southeast, actually. Stamp on the NCFD certificate was from the southern region. Farm models a petrochem design. So that eliminates any others, which narrows it down to Edgewood Farm. That's gotta be our place. So, we've got it. Just hope we didn't fuck it up. Come on, we gotta go. Done more in two days than the NCPD accomplished in weeks. Not hard to do, but yeah, you're right. Thanks, V. For everything. We'll find him, River. <sighs> if I'd only known sooner how he felt, what was eating at him. This isn't your fault. I'm his uncle, V. And I wasn't there for him. Fuck!
up something. River, this is the farm. We got it. I know. Let's get to the barn quick. More turrets. That front gate's attacked. up tight. Need to find another way. River! Come here, quick! Hanging in there. We made it. V, shut down the machine. Can't unlink Randy otherwise. Randy! 1052. I repeat, I've got a 1052 at a farm south of the city. Yes, send the fucking squad! Yeah, we're laying coordinates now. No, several, at least. Do it quick, dammit! Oh, and watch for automated defenses on site. They're substantial. Hurry! Gotta shut it off! Okay, all disconnected. Check the others. Could still be alive. Right. Move on. Whoa, 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 easy there. You're all right now. Been dead a few days already. V, help me with Randy. It's okay. Don't don't be scared. We're here to help. 
A bit dehydrated, but you are gonna be fine. V, help me with Randy! Need to look... Did it, River? Yep. We sure did. But I'm not about to leave it like this. The horror that bastard inflicted. Can't let it go. What do you want to do? Zero him? Exactly. Squeeze the life out of him with my bare hands. Sick fuck has to die. No, River. I want that fucker's blood on my hands, too. Appreciate your dedication, V. But this is between me and Harris. I'm gonna take him out in my own way. Amidst all this confusion. Just remember. Say the word, I'm there. You can count on me. Need a little time to myself now. But I'll remember. Hey, we're ready for evac. Are you riding along or not? Really, V. Thanks. Couldn't have done it without you. Don't mention it. And holler if you change your mind. Or if you're just in the mood to holler. So now that we have completed the mission, The Hunt, and completed those dialogue choices and those objectives, we are ready to wait for another River phone call. Now, so what you want to do is leave that area and start skipping 24-hour periods and seeing if he calls in between those. Now, this was the hardest River phone call for me to get. What I ended up having to do is let the game sit idle for about 20 minutes staring at the street. I did skip a lot of 24-hour periods to check on it, but that just didn't seem to work. So I just let the game sit idle for a while. It took about 20 minutes of just staring at the street before he finally called. Another thing that you can do is start another side job. And about midway through, he should call you. One other trick that you can try is to go to your apartment, sleep three times in a row, and then go back out of your apartment down onto the street and see if you get the phone call. Once you do get that phone call, he will give you the mission following the river. Now you want to head back to his neighborhood. Once you get in there, you are going to sit and wait for him. And then that mission will start. I am going to leave this full mission in here and all those dialogue choices just in case anybody's having any problems. I will give you the correct dialogue choices if you're trying to romance him. But if you are not trying to romance him, you can still get the achievement slash trophy at the end of this. Glad you're here. Oh, I need hey. your help cooking. Hi. What's on the menu? Jambalaya. Hey. Come on. How's it you going? Stir the meat. Uh, soy meat. Okay. Oh no. Maybe Joss would be more help. Joss did her bit. Just grab the damn spoon and start stirring. This is an ancient Ward family secret. Uh huh. Onions, paprika, thyme. Just need to mince some celery and garlic. But you stir, please. Stir. I'm stirring, I'm stirring. Bet my socks you've never had better jambalaya. Don't mean to spoil a nice day, but... I gotta ask. What about Peter Pan? You're asking if I killed him. 
We'll talk later, okay? Sure. No pressure. It's just I... You know. I know. All right. Think you've stirred enough? Mind grabbing the rice from the kitchen? Yes, sir. No, Randy's always been that way. But I'm sure this didn't help none. You know, his... Um, where will I find the rice? I'll call you back later. Really nice Basmati. of you to come. nice. How's Randy? Still in the hospital. Still in shock. But he's making progress. Haven't had a chance to tell you just how grateful I am. I was all river. I just helped. I just don't know how to repay you. If Randy Don't had... owe me a thing, Joss. <laughs> I'm so quick to break down. Anyway, the rice is right there. Tomatoes in next. Now you can toss in the rice. Rice is in. Okay, now this has to bubble and brew. Patio. Grab a chair. And a beer or something else. It's nice out here. Yeah. Seems all good. Like nothing bad ever happened. Tell me now, about Harris. I paid him a visit at the hospital. You flatline him? I wasn't sure that was what I really wanted. One shot to the head. Quick and clean. I had the same thought. It would be so easy. I pressed the gun to his head and remembered something. River. Oh, my parents died. Oh, you sure you want to hear this? What happened? Old man had a farm, like Harris's dad. But when business took a turn, well... My parents managed to open a small grocery. We lived on the floor above. A loud noise woke us one night. They wanted cash. Register was empty, so they stormed upstairs, forced us all to kneel, and demanded my dad tell him where he hid the money. Mostly, I remember my mom crying. My dad swore they'd found all we had. One was gassed out of his mind. He fired first. Blew half my dad's skull off. Jesus. River. I'm sorry. He was erratic. Went rabid. Handed me his gun and ordered me to aim it at my mom's head. I can still see her tear-filled eyes at the end of that barrel to this day. What did you do? Nothing. I stood frozen. Finally, he just snatched the gun back. Shot my mother and they left. Police never caught him. That was why I joined the force. I couldn't agree with scum like that roaming free. No one to hound him. Can't tell you how sorry I am. So when I stood over Harris in that hospital bed, barrel to his brow, I was that kid again. But I was also the junkie who shot my parents. I understand. I've ended a few lives in my time. 
But never like that. Never an execution. Slipped out of the hospital quick. Told myself the case was closed. That's good. But when now? You're not going back to the PD? P.I. has a nice ring to it. Who knows? Uncle we'll River, see. you said you'd play with us. You promised. All right, all right. Let's go. Me? Join us? What are we gonna play, Uncle River? You'll see. Dorian, we're playing! Yeah, big trouble in Haywood. Grab your set. Well, what do you think? Always wanted to try a game like this. Well, well. Nice firepower there. This is no time to get distracted. We can't let that filth get away. Oh, well, look at you. V, allow me to introduce Captain Joan McLean and Lieutenant Henry Callahan. They're our precinct's best and brightest. Wouldn't want to get in their way. I always work alone. No exceptions. Even for you. Yeah, me too. All right, let's get to it. Right. All we gotta do is track down El Chamuco y Diablado and take out his lackeys along the way. He'll pay for his crimes. We play like two teams, us and the kids. But we work toward the same objective. The team with the best result wins. You don't stand a chance. Navy, just go easy, okay? It's their favorite game. Sure. Oh, there he is! Get him! The city's mine! You'll never take her from me! <laughs> He's fast, but not fast enough to escape justice. <gasps> Watch out! It's cronies! <laughs> take that! Not done yet! Next round, next round! This way. It must be their rat-infested hideouts. I could smell the moral decay from a mile off. It's a trap! They were waiting for us! <laughs> Too slow! Too many donuts! Not Bam! done yet! Behind it! Hey! I have better aim! Okay, that's all of them. The next time we gotta be faster!
see you squirm. No! Your last words! <laughs> oh, come on. Another ambush? Okay, so now... Lunch is ready. Uh... But, Mom, you almost had him. Oh, you'll get him next time. At least we beat the grown-ups. We're the best! Thanks for letting him win. They had fun. Oh, they're great kids. It's no problem. Seems they took a liking to you, too. Hey! Food's on the table. So? Was your game fun? Awesome! <laughs> we kicked their big butts! The bad guys? Huh? Oh, yeah! The bad guys, too! Time to see if this tastes as good as it smells. Unemployment's being good to you. You seem good. River's discovering the joys of family life. That and police duty. Never a good mix. This here's a way to get some of those years back. I haven't seen him this... untroubled in a while. What about you, V? You got a family? Or just relations? If the future allows it, I'd like to have one someday. If for no other reason than that I love get-togethers like this. Well, you brought my family back to me, and I'm grateful. If you say so, Joss. And my brother likes you. Joss? Well, why hide it? Come on, Joss. You don't see wedding bells in my future, surely? Why not? Who thinks me and Uncle River make a good couple? <laughs> I do. <laughs> v just voted. Well, that's decided. Got an 1199. Officer needs backup. Come on, pull you out of this ambush. Thanks, Joss. Yeah, thanks. Whew, situation was getting dicey. That's what partners are for. You were about a hair's breadth away from having to look at photo albums. This a romantic stroll, by chance? Not about to pick you flowers, if that's what you're asking. Here we are. What are we looking at? A water tower. Great spot. Great for what? For, you know, the views. The views. Right. This way I... Oh, fuck. Gate stuck again. Gonna fix it one of these days. Let me give you a boost. Climb over, open it from the other side. Yeah. Okay. Good. Just push. Uh, seems easier to... Okay. On our way. Area's not bad, actually. Unlikely to dazzle. Make a good first impression, though. Certainly no Corpo Plaza. No. But life's livable here. No worse places to raise kids. Randy's problems with the law. Those didn't pop out of thin air. True. But Randy takes after his old man. He'd find trouble in a nicer neighborhood, too. Apparently the worst city between the Atlantic and the Pacific. But I sure do love this view. 
Find it calming. Used to die for. Great spot indeed. Told you. Got something for you. Your peace? Had her a long time. Too long. I think it's time she found a new owner. Don't know what to say. Just promise you won't blow your foot off. Oddly specific request. Josh's husband did it. Drunk. In this very spot. Which made this your special spot. Family landmark? Something of the kind. All right, V. You know why we're here, don't you? Say you do. Please, don't string me along. That the pickup line you settled on? Because maybe you heard three in my life that were worse. And just a little at that. Wouldn't mind hearing them. Yeah. Happy to oblige. So I'm at a bar, and this gonk taps me on the shoulder and says, Here I am, baby. You got two wishes left. What'd you say? Spoke my second wish. That he would fuck off. Was there a third? Mm-hmm. Wished him a speedy recovery. Broken arm. Merciful, I'd say. I'll fuck you for free. <laughs> what? Got a contract. To pull info out of a gigolo in a tech mink fedora. It was weird. He was spilling. And then he pulled that one out of his hat. A candid and generous proposal, V. You should have at least considered it. Will you swallow? Beautiful. <laughs> you serious? This guy and I, sitting in a diner. Five minutes, he gapes at me. Not a word. Then drops that bomb. Oof. <laughs> Okay, last one was good. You know, woman once told me I have sexy calves. That's it? Just like her boyfriends. Before he lost his legs in the war. Yikes. She was right, though. I do have great calves. I see what you're doing, River. And how am I doing? Do I stand a chance? Just don't fall in love with me. Too late, V. Too late. And now we will get the river romance scene. I'm going to have to cut that out because I cannot show any nudity on my channel. But right after that's done, you will go talk to him in the kitchen over a cup of coffee. Right after that's over, you will get your achievement slash trophy to protect and serve. And that is for completing the river storyline. And that is going to be wrapping up in tree 24. As always, I hope this walkthrough guide has been super helpful. If it has been, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. If you have any questions at any time, feel free to drop a comment down below, or you can hit me up personally on my Instagram. The link is in the description box, and I'll see you guys next time. Goaltat, signing off.